So what's up guys? Today I want to talk to you guys about my setup and how I like to have things set up around the shop and my different carts so that I can produce you know, the way that I like to. So I figured I'd show you guys what I use and stuff that may help you guys and how I like to keep things close by. That way I'm able to be most efficient and not have to walk far to do things. So let me show you what I, how I do it. First of all, inside the mixing room, I took the doors off the cabinets of a regular, uh, like a Dido's cabinet and I keep everything right here in front of me so I could just grab quick and be right on the scale. So it, everything's right in front of me. And then off to my right is my mixing bank to the side so I can just grab at it from the right and go right in because I'm righty. So I had them set that up like that. And then my D cups are right here in reach. So everything's in reach. Maybe with a step away, I can uh, get to everything inside here. So I like it like that. I like having all my stuff set up to the way that I like to move so I can be more efficient, guys. Um, you know, when things are further away or out of reach and you gotta move and walk across the shop to get to something, it could slow you down. And through the week, it's a lot more uh, than you think you're losing time on. So, so that's the mixing room and how I like to set it up. And I'll show you some of my carts outside that I have that I use in different areas. So stay tuned. So here's my cart right out in front of the booth. Here's the booth door and I have a cart from uh, Innovative Tools right here. And I keep all my stuff that I'm gonna need when I'm in the booth. I got my chip guard gun there. You guys know I like the 3M uh, rock guard gun set up. I got my uh, N95 masks, my prep saw, my waterborne cleaner. And I just keep a, a, a different setup over here so that I can get to it quick. I got my spray out cords. These are all my cards that I have sprayed out of colors that I know I, I have dialed in. And then I have my new ones over here, so I have them ready. And then I'll keep different cans of spray paint and uh, my tack rags on this side, the crystals. Thousand grit in case I got a nib out, a nib or something in the base. And then I keep my sunlight right here. So this is right here close by the door. So I'm, I got access to everything. I got my rags when I'm cleaning down parts but I like keeping my stuff right in my area. That way I don't have to go far to get to it because you wouldn't believe how much time you lose when you start walking all over the place for stuff. So right next to the door here is my, also my guns. I made this rack and it holds the guns. So I keep them right near the door. I can come out and in and boom. I don't like keeping my, my guns in the booth because I don't like getting that base coat hot because it, it doesn't like heat as far as when the gun is, uh, the paint's warm. So I don't like getting my gun real hot so I keep it out here so it doesn't get uh, too hot, but everything's in the same vicinity of where I'm gonna actually do the work. And the same thing with my cart, when I'm prepping a car out. My cart's got wheels on it and I'll roll around and go to the job. I have everything right in front of me, what I need. That way I don't have any time of walking and wasting time, guys. So I just wanted to show you how I do it. It's got a trash can in it. Everything is set up to be right there in front of me where I'm at and depending on what job I'm doing. So that's key to what you want to do is get stuff in, in the area and it'll save you a lot of time to where you have everything right there set up. So even here, I'll show you outside or right here actually, I got my little buffing set up. So when a car comes out of the booth, the booth's right here. I can hit a nib real fast and boom, the car's ready to go to, to get assembled. And then I keep all my parts out here for the body men to pick up. But I also have a hose outside right by the booth, right by my area if I wanna wash something off. So all these things, to have them close by, it saves you a lot of time. And uh, I use all the innovative tool stands um, for flipping parts around and all that stuff like that. So just, Try to be efficient on having stuff close by, guys. It'll save you a lot of time, and it'll definitely get you through the day faster, and you wouldn't believe what that'll save you. You know, that's why McDonald's and all these different restaurants, they build these conveyor belts and have stuff real close by, because it saves money, and it saves time, and, it, and it'll save your back and save your legs from walking all over the place all day. So try to be more efficient and have things close by. But I just wanted to show you some of the stuff I use to uh, through the day that I like and pretty much is a must for me. So also one of the things I like to use is this paint suit here. 
This is a, called an apron with sleeves and it's made by Sherwin. And this is the part number if anybody's interested in it, but being on prepping cars, I don't want to have to get in and out of a paint suit every time I prep a car out or go back in the booth. So it has a zipper on it. The back's halfway open. I don't know if you guys could see it, but it's mesh and the front's down pretty low, but the side's not, so it's not too hot. I like using that. And then of course I use my Papper, um, my 3M VersaFlow uh, hood setup. You know, you want to keep this paint out of your eyes. That's more important than sometimes the lungs because it goes right into your bloodstream with that. So always wear a hood, safety glasses, something to keep it out of your eyes. But these are just some of the things I got to have when I'm painting and it's helped me to make more money. So make things come close to you. I also have a little uh, booth box I made that you could keep, you know, different stuff in and it's close by some of my combi putty there in case anybody gets pinholes. So just keep your stuff close by and um, you know it'll it'll help you out through the day to get things done quicker guys.